Hey guys, I'm back again. Gonna be bringing you another video today. Uh, it's gonna be just another strike. Gonna be trying to run all seven strikes, give you all the, you know, tips, tricks, and those strikes that is possibly there. And uh, I'm gonna see how these two videos do, and see if I want to do the rest of them. The Dust Palace is lost to us again, back in Cabal hands. Word is they've let Scion flayers out of their cages to dig around in the central AI's cortex which means they really want what's buried in there. If Rasputin was protecting it, it's valuable. We've got to flush those flares out. And, um, and if these videos you guys don't like, I'll come up with something else. Uh, but basically this is the Dust Palace strike. Um, we've got to climb all the way to the tower on Mars to fight these three Scion bosses. And before that we have a bunch of ad rooms. Um, so for me, this one is harder than the Shield Brothers just because of the ad rooms. Um, the bosses, they're kind of a pain in the ass. I wouldn't, I don't know if I should say that they're really hard. Um, they're just hard to shoot at basically because they're so tiny. You know, compared to a big, um, uh, Cabal boss, you know, where they're pretty fat and you have a lot of places where you can do damage on them. You'll see what I mean when they uh, spawn. So basically, uh, after you you know come in here, you just take this route, the same route that I'm doing. It's easy. You just keep following your motion sensor, keep going downstairs. Here, now here's a little tricky part. When I did this, like first couple times, I thought we had to go into that um, into that room and go downstairs. But actually, you go into this room and you turn right, um, and then the taken spawn. And then you just go to the store, take out your ghost, and your ghost is going to have to open this door. And while he's doing that, a bunch of uh, enemies are going to spawn. Sometimes they're taken, sometimes they're just regular uh, Cabal, sometimes they're just regular Vex. Like I said in my other video, there's about um, three, somewhere around three uh, variations of the strikes. And something that I forgot to mention in uh, the video is that compared to year one strikes, the strikes in year two, um, the bosses are going to be the ones that are going to be dropping the um, rewards for you. So if you don't get anything at the rewards page, uh, that's why. But you do get some stuff at the rewards page, uh, but not all the time. Um, you'll, sometimes you'll get like uh, deep coherent Ingram. Uh, sometimes you'll get one, two, maybe three strange coins. Sometimes you'll get maybe one, two, three muscle light. So it just depends, you know. Depends how the game is feeling. And then you go into this room, and this room has a lot more ads in it. Usually. But we got a Cabal and Taken this time around here. Sometimes there are uh, three mini bosses in this room. Um, I forget what they're called. They're, they're Vex. Um, Vex Divine, like, Mines or something. They're, like, big. They, uh, you guys, you guys know what I'm talking about. If I can literally describe them, they're like you know these tall things that are like eyeballs and they shoot at you. I think they're called cyclopses. I could be wrong, but yeah, there's three cyclopses that shoot at you. So you clear out that. Go up here. There's more enemies, and then you have those uh, taken flanks that shoot you with their shield and toss you everywhere. Yeah, it's just a bunch of ads, you know. It's kind of annoying. And, um, these variations in these strikes, like, because this door is not supposed to be open, and it is, so. Uh, I can never tell which strike I'm run like, running, like, which variation of the strike. So, I mean, it's kind of awesome that they do it that way because you're not going to get, like, 100% bored with the same strike over and over again. Like, if it was exactly the same, I would probably be very bored. But, um, I'm not too bored since, you know, it's not, it's not, like, 100% the same. Like, the bosses are going to be the same, obviously, but, um, like, the mini-bosses and the adds are, um, usually different every time you do the strike. That's pretty cool. 
it was probably gonna be a minute before Destiny comes out with uh, more content, so. Do we gotta try to do what we can to not be bored with doing the same thing over and over again. So yeah, you just have a bunch of ad rooms. Um, there's a Hydra there that doesn't usually spawn, but uh, like I said, variation. Uh, are there any mini bosses? There are no mini bosses. Uh, sometimes you. Now this is pretty cool. Uh, you can uh, put down a turret in some locations on strike missions. Um, it's pretty awesome. Sometimes this door is open and you kill people in here. Sometimes it's not. Oh, and that is a legendary Ingram. Yep, and my teammate found one too. So that's pretty sick. Usually there's more ads in this room. I get I get so confused with the variations. I really do, cause like I'm I'm ready for like you know two more waves of enemies and they don't come. So whatever. Uh, that just means that we're gonna get this done you know quicker and faster, and we are already in the boss room. This is the boss room. So uh, here you have a bunch of flankses and uh, legendaries and all that stuff. You gotta kill the the centurion, all that. And then you have to take out your ghost again after my teammate kills that guy. <clears throat> and then your ghost is gonna have to press a couple buttons here, scan some stuff, whatever. And then he is going to summon the boss. Um, the bosses for us. So there's three different bosses. They're all identical. They all look the same. They just have different names. They're, they're basically like triplets. And I'll sh you'll see in a second why these uh, bosses are kind of kind of annoying. So as you can see, they are Scion bosses, uh, Kolar, Scion Flare. Um, they're all called Scion Flares, but each of them have a different name. They're just annoying because they're tiny, they're skinny, kind of hard to shoot at, you know, compared to, and they move around a lot. Uh, unless you're using your super, which is what I just did, but I usually just take out my rockets, use my super, and they're uh, dead in no time. But there's three of them, so that's why this is kind of a pain in the butt. Um, but it looks like my teammates killed all three of them, so well done. There's the other one on the ground there. So uh, this is, I think this is a little bit quicker video than the Shield Brothers one. We're going to have to look at the uh, time frame. But it looks like I did not, I, I did pop a three of coins before I started this video, so I unfortunately only got one Ingram there. That's kind of weird. Usually the, uh, the bosses drop at least two... Uh, decoherent Ingram, so that's kind of weird. But I did get a legendary, so I can't really complain now, can I? Um, so yeah. So yeah, the rewards page, you don't get too much now because the bosses usually poop out uh, the Ingrams that you get. But, you know, there's a strange coin. You know, sometimes you get a strange coin, maybe one, two, three. So yeah, that was the, um, the Solar Flare, Scion Flare, whatever you want to call, Strike Mission. And um, that's basically how you do it. Uh, I mean, there's not many, too many tricks and stuff. I mean, I showed you that you can lay down a uh, turret and stuff, but I just wanted to run through these strikes for anybody that hasn't seen them. Um, you know, maybe you'll, maybe I do it in a way that you don't do it, and maybe you want to, you know, try it my way or something. I don't know. Just trying to see if you guys uh, need any help on the strikes, uh, even though they've been out since the 15th, and this is kind of a late video series, but. Uh, anyways, uh, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more Destiny content coming soon. I am going to be having a lot of spare time uh, during the next four days, so I will be uploading a bunch of content for you guys. Uh, depending on how these videos do, will depend on if I do the rest of the strikes. I probably will anyway, you know, just for just for shits and giggles and stuff. But um, hope you guys enjoyed it. And be on the lookout for more content. I will see you guys in a day or two. Alright, bye.